Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars Diecast Review. And today we're going to take a look at Davey Apex alias Dave Alternators, the Revolting Piston Cup Racer number 84. <clears throat> now before we get right into the review, let me discuss something. So, Davey Apex alias Dave Alternators is a Crown Celesta Piston Cup racer that raced for Revolting, the rebuilt Alternators, and bore the number 84, which he shared the same number as Mac Icar, along with other Apple racers, such as JP Drive and the nameless Apple Stock Car in Cars 3, which they haven't been released by Mattel, and can be customized by some fans. In 2005, he, he was one of the racers to attend the Dynaco 400 at the Motor Speedway of the South and was one of the ra racers to be involved in the multi-car wreck caused by Chick Hicks. And his spa in between 2006 and 2015, and in, in spite of receipt getting into the wreck, he was able to continue racing and was able to finish the race. Between 2006 and 2015, he no longer raced for Revolting. His sponsor, Revolting, was seen as a battery brand in Toy Story 3, and during his diecast releases, he has been released numerous of times as singles and in multi-packs and has been re-released for this year as a single as Dave Alternators. And now, without any further ado, let's dig right into the review. Here we've got his determined facial expression, his headlight stickers and with a number 84 on one of them, his black grill, and on the hood with the black background, we've got the Revolting logo saying Revolting Rebuild Alternators. And on the left and both sides, we've got the dark gray rims on the black wall light year tires and the exhaust pipes and Revolting logo and gas cap and white number 84. And several sponsor logos saying Piston Cup, Nitrate, Revolting, his sponsor, Octane Gain, Mood Springs, Vitaline, No Stall, Gaskets, Gasprin, Easy Idle, RPM, Little Torquey Pistons, Leakless, Retrain, and Clutch Shade. And on the top, we've got another number 84, No Name Signature. And on the trunk, we've got another Revolting logo, the Dark Red Spoiler. And on the back, we've got another Revolting logo, saying Revolting, Rebuilt Alternators, and the taillight stickers with the number 84 on one of them and on the right side similar design but completely different and now let's pull up some of the other Crown Celestas we've got Misty Motocross even though her diecast mold shares the same as Claude Scruggs Ruby Easy Oaks even though he shares the same diecast mold as Aiken Axler Manny Flywheel, Ryan, and Ryan Shields. And, and some of the other Piston Cup racers that share his body mold. We've got Brush Kerber, even though he's a Sherpa Motors Lola GT. And the Capital Motors mm, Verve XTs, Winford Bradford Rutherford. Dirk San Diego Stino, and Slider Petrolski. And some of the other Toy Story 3 cameos we've got Lightning McQueen, Snotrod, Van, Finn McMissile, and, and the other Pixar cameos we've got. Strip the King Weathers, whose sponsor Dynaco made a background appearance in Toy Story, 
in Toy Story 4 in Wally. -E. Al Oft, the Lightyear blimp, who's named Lightyear, is a reference to Goodyear tires, and the toy one of the characters from Toy Story trilogy was Lightyear. And some more Pixar or Easter eggs. We've got Michael Mike B. Wazowski. And I wish I'd have Sully and the Yeti, but I for unfortunately I don't have them. And, but hopefully if I get Sully and the Yeti, I will review Michael Mike B. Wazowski. Ham from Toy Story, who shares the same voice actor as Mac. Buzz Lightcar, Sheriff Woody, Mater, whose license plate reads A113, which is the code number for many Pixar films, Todd the Pizza Planet, who is a traditional Pixar Easter egg, Bill, who, who shares who has the Luxo Junior Ball on the hood and the colors and the number 86 to reference the year that Pixar was founded. Luigi, who made a cameo in Finding Nemo. And Doc Hudson, who made a background cameo in The Incredibles. And that is it. So what do you guys think? Which Crown Celesta Piston Cup Racer is your favorite? Which Piston Cup Racer shares Davy Apex's diecast mold? And which Pixar Easter egg is your favorite also? Let me know what you think as well as leaving suggestions of which car to review next in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And don't, and please don't forget to check out my other videos on my channel. And I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Goodbye now!